Mainland Grenada boasts of 23 surface and 6 drinking water supply sources. Even so, water remains a scarce resource and a growing challenge due to climate change, experienced through more intense dry seasons and erratic rainfall. With a population of just over 100,000, the situation is even more distressing for homeowners who are not connected to the distribution network. Rainwater harvesting is one option encouraged under the G-Cruise project as a beneficial practice for homeowners who frequently experience water shortage challenges. The initiative simultaneously encourages positive water habits through conservation. There are two types of rainwater harvesting. There is one that we call domestic rainwater harvesting, where water is harvested for use at the household level. And there is other rainwater harvesting that you see here. It's also collected from the roof, but it is used essentially for agriculture. We had this rainwater system for over 10 years now going. Um, the reason why we installed the system is because during the dry season, we had issues with getting water from Nawasa in the pipe. So we had the system installed and so that we could get our daily tasks done as the days went by. We use this rain, the rainwater from this system for every household need you could think about. From washing to cooking, cleaning, uh, bathing, yeah. Um, so during the dry season, when we have that problem, we use it to cook and to wash and all that our household chores, right? Sometimes we may, we may use it for, for drinking, but not all the time. The rainwater that I have is at present is used mainly for the farm, but I do at times use in the house for like mopping or flushing of the toilet if there is no water. The roof space of an average bedroom could provide as much as two 45-gallon barrels of water using the most basic collection system. You have a well-designed house, you have the roof system, you have a guttering system, and you take the water into probably a concrete system, some storage. Rainwater harvesting systems can be as simple as collecting rain in a barrel or extend to the use of large plastic tanks or underground concrete tanks, also known as cisterns. The choice is based entirely on the user's requirements or preference and can be added to existing infrastructure or included in the design of new premises. Falling rain provides some of the cleanest, naturally occurring, available water. It is multi-purpose and best of all, free. Use it. The Climate Resilient Water Sector in Grenada, g -Cruise Project, is jointly financed by the GCF, the German government and the government of Grenada.